13 News Now is your back to school station. Just this week, Warhill High School has four newly confirmed coronavirus cases. That's in Williamsburg, James City County School Division. The division itself has a total of 17 cases since July 1st. Megan Shin spoke with the superintendent about those numbers. This is the first week the divisions brought high school staff into the building four days a week. And if you look at the coronavirus dashboard for Williamsburg, James City County, you'll notice there's an outbreak of COVID-19 at Warhill High School. Superintendent Dr. Olin Heron says it's mainly from one department and they have COVID-19 mitigation policies in place. I'm confident that they're working. I think when something has happened, uh, the virus has been brought in from the outside by someone with a contact that they've had that's had COVID-19. Still, Warhill's principal will ask the school staff to stay at home and teach virtually for two weeks while the Peninsula Health Department does contact tracing. To protect staff because their safety comes first. Heron says she speaks with principals almost every week. Leadership in the building becomes extremely important right now in monitoring what staff are doing and creating high expectations to implement our protocols. Right now, high school students in the division are learning remotely. It's not the same, but, you know, trying to make the best out of it. Warhill senior McKinley Dowdy says she just heard about her school's outbreak. It makes me not really want to go back. <laughs> Uh, but at the same time, I want to, but I'm also, you know, I don't want to get COVID. The division is scheduled to bring 6th and 12th grade students back on November 30th. However, with Thanksgiving around the corner, Heron says plans might change. There is a strong likelihood that we will change the schedule that we've currently published. Megan Shin, 13 News Now.